Hello everyone! Today I'll show you how to add a polygon primitive, or a shape, into PMX Editor and how to apply a texture to it. The first thing you want to do is add your shape. You could either just do Control P on your keyboard, or you could go into Edit and do Simple Primitive Add, and this will pop up. You have a series of shape options you could add in here. For now, we're just going to do a box. Over here, you get a how, to, how many rows you want on it. I'm just going to leave it how it is now, and over here, that's where the shape will show up on your keyboard. Right now, it's just set to the origin, and I'm going to keep it that way. Once you're set with what you want to add in, click on adding, and this will show up. As you can see, it's just a blank shape here. To add the wireframe, just toggle W on your keyboard, and it will pop up into wireframe. And there's kind of a better view of the wireframe view. I'll leave it at this view for now. Now we want to add a texture. To do this, you go under Edit, UV Expressions Create, UV Morph Create. We want to start out by selecting what we want to add our texture to. Sorry, it's lagging a little bit. So I have selected the box, and then click on Image Loading, and pick what you what texture you want to add to it. And the texture will load in here. Over here is where you can edit how many times it will, like, repeat onto your texture. Right now it's just set to 500. Click on UV Morph here to apply the texture to your model. Or shape. But let's say it's add and you see how it's kind of weird here. Maybe you don't want that. You could just play around. We'll reselect your shape. Go back into here. You can play around with this here to see how it will be tiled onto your shape. See, now it looks a little better. So just keep playing around with these buttons until you get the position that you want. You can also use here to change like the position of the texture. I'll keep it to there. And do the image of frames per number. And that's just to play around with until you get the tile texture that you prefer. So here is kind of a better view. And that's it for now. If you have any comments, just leave them below. And thank you for watching.